guys, check this uh, owl lamp out. Very cool. And they went, I'm trying not to get anybody's face in. 25 bucks. But the thing is, it's got a huge cleaver over here and a huge cleaver over there. So that is pretty cool. Take a picture and. Guys, check this thing out. It is a donut cooker. Pretty sure. <laughs> NSF and it's 89 bucks with the lid over here uh, That's what it looks like or you could do I guess hot dogs or corn dogs or whatnot in it. I'll take a quick little picture of that and Off I go It's still out of my uh, Goodwill Over in Sarasota and I found this it's a doll. It's a doll bassinet Wow, that's really cool <laughs> Looks like it's from the 50s probably they went 13 bucks for it. Wow. That's really, really cool. It's got like the peasant girl over there. Peasant and the peasant boy. I'm guessing, I don't know. Very cool. Okay, off I go. Not for me. In this one little section, it's like all this really neat stuff. There's like a Raggedy Ann doll thing. Very cute. Two bucks. A little pelican. For three bucks. A little uh, vase, I guess, for two dollars. And over here was this really cool English, looks like an English uh, post post office thing, box thing. And that's two dollars. It's a bank. Pretty cool. And then there's a Holland um, beer can opener, or bottle opener, I mean. Very cool stuff. <laughs> it's all in one spot. Okay, up I go. Hey guys, check this out. It is a snack bowl. Snacks, nuts, chips, and more nuts, and popcorn, and pretzels. It's really cool. Very, very neat. And how much is it? Sorry. It's only four bucks. <laughs> That's mine all day. Okay, take a picture, and up I go. <laughs> winner winner Hey guys check this out. It's like a shell bowl with a really cool drippy glaze uh, Drippy glaze on it. Wow, that's really pretty really pretty with the blue and the green And this is six bucks and it's uh, signed on the bottom WW You know very neat and back here. It looks like a couple of fish. I, I don't know if they're catfish or whatever it looks kind of funky Made in Japan, three dollars. I guess that's three dollars a piece, of course. And uh, okay, <laughs> not for me. I'm getting a snack bowl. Okay, off I go. You guys, check it out. There are two Pyrex bowls. One there, and one there. Seven bucks. Wow, pretty cool. Okay, neat. Off I go. Yep, getting one of them. <laughs> hey guys, I saw this out of the corner of my eye. Yep, it's a little club pot pan in the red with the burnt orange, the burnt red thing around the top there. Very cool. For six bucks, a little high for me, but neat. Take a picture of you. Off I go. Okay guys, this definitely made me laugh. I can't believe I drank the whole thing, so it's like a like a gallon, <laughs> I guess it was like a beer barrel. Anyway, thought that was interesting. And off I go. Hey guys, check this out. It's one of those wiener dog, hot dog, uh, caddy things for 10 bucks. It's a little bit, a little bit high, but worth a little picture. Not for me. Okay, off I go. Eyes off in the corner, I saw the polar bear. Uh, the stinkifier for your refrigerator. You put your baking soda in there, and that's what it's for. I guess Rita made it a little hard over her eye. <laughs> and they, this is only 99 cents. Very cool. It's a refrigerator deodorizer gizmo. Very cool. Off I go. Not for me. <laughs> I actually think I sold one a couple years ago. Eh, didn't get very much for it. Guys, I am at, at my Habitat for Humanity over here in um, Sarasota and they've got a really nice it's a teak Danish desk wow for 400 bucks neat very neat 
It's the newer stuff, but cool nonetheless. Take a picture. Not for me. <laughs> Fun. Hey guys, it's a really neat. Uh, it's like a faux bamboo chair with like a chenille in it. Like 80 bucks. It's a bit on the high side, y'all. <laughs> Not for me. Cool though. A little pricey. Off I go. Guys, I am out at my uh, other Goodwill off of 301, and it is a stereo cabinet. Remember back in the day, everybody had one of these things. 30 bucks they went for it. People don't do it anymore. They do their Bluetooth gizmo. So anyway, I'll go. Hey guys, check it out. It's one of those Margaritaville mixer machine things. Wow, how much you want for that? 30 bucks. I got a Vitamix that I got a Goodwill for 20. <laughs> Sorry, next. Off I go. They almost missed this. <laughs> I was looking up. And it's a, uh, what is it? Let's coffee, coffee clatch. Uh, hot in my cup and one lump or two, I'll make it black. That is pretty cool. <laughs> How much do you want? 13 bucks. I will do a big pass on you, but it was worth a looky loo. Okay. Off I go. It's back here. It looks like a French horn. I thought it was Sirocco, but it's another uh, dark, dark thing. It's signed. And where is it? Upside down, always with that damn upside down. And there it is, it's Dart, Indiana. Made in the USA. Cool, not for me, but uh, how much? I don't see a price on you anywhere. Put you back over here. Oh, and look over here, there's a, <laughs> it's a banjo, little rattan looking thing. That's kind of cool. Not really for me, how much you want? Uh, five bucks. Neat, not for me, off I go. Guys, check it out, it's a Mickey Mouse tree. Uh, I think it's like a cookie jar or something. How much you want for that, 10 bucks. That's kind of cool. Not really for me, but interesting enough. Okay, and off I go. This here's a kind of a funny thing. It's a Riverboat Avon bottle. And it is, uh, what is it? Wild country. God, that stuff smells terrible. <laughs> oh my God. Very, very funny. Okay. Not for me. Oops. What are you? Three bucks. Definitely not for me. Off I go. You guys, check this out. It's a kinetic swing. Very cute. It's got a top balance thing on it. That is just too cute. Wow. They were four bucks for it. That is neat. Hey guys, here's a cool little snag for eight bucks. It's a Pyrex butter dish. It's a cool little pattern on it. They sell for like 15 or 20. Definitely gotta get that. Okay, off I go. In the bag. Uh, hey guys, here's a little blast in the past. It's some uh, milk glass. There's some uh, hobnail stuff and the little top hat. Five dollars for the top hat. Sorry if I was off. And uh, not really my bag, but worth a little looky loo. Off I go. Guys, I thought this was kind of cool. It is a garlic roasting pot, and it's really nice. It's a nice piece of pottery. It's got a little hole in it up there. Uh, with the garlic on top of it, you can see the little cloves. There's no maker's mark on the bottom, but it's done really well. And how much do you guys want for this? It is eight bucks. That is too damn cool. I don't need it, <laughs> but off I go. Hey guys, check this out. It's a purple, what looks like a Hager. They went nine bucks, and it's Hager. Always upside down, and it's Hager. Very cool. Take a picture of that. Uh, not really what I do, not my color, but I like it. And over here, it looks like it's a little sloth. It's a little hanging sloth. <laughs> it's not mid-century or anything, but it's cute. Four bucks. <laughs> anyway, I thought it was funny. Off I go.
you guys are over here off of the corner is a um look like an etching of a ship get over here get away from people and uh let me take a picture of you and where are you it is to the something of Borton. i can't make it out vice admiral of the red something anyway six bucks they won for it it's old it's on some sort of burlap stuff over here and over here it says uh Hand produced on stainless steel in Cornwall, England, and connoisseur steel production. This picture should require little cleaning, but metal polish may be used if desired. Okay, uh, there we go. Uh, blue Cornwall, something or other. And anyway, not for me, but interesting enough. Six bucks, and off I go. Hey guys, check this out. It is a little deer trinket box from uh, Murphy, North Carolina, and it's uh, four dollars. That is too cute. Is there anything inside? Nope, just a little cedar box. Neat. <laughs> that is precious. Take a little picture and off I go. Check it out. I found a macrame plant holder, but I put the pot in there so you can get the thing. But it's got like black swans on it and their heads are busted off and they wanted uh, four bucks for it yeah you know I, I'd have got it if it wasn't broken but uh cool enough anyway uh, off I go